everybody. Healy. Healy is your inspiration. Bread is up. You guys want to book a one-on-one -on -one consultation, you can do that by sending us an email at info at Healy Through Inspiration. Or you can DM us on Instagram at Healing Through Inspiration. We post followers. We post there on a regular. You dig what I'm saying? Um, out there in the forest. I was out here in nature. Um, also, too, I want to tell you guys, we want to book. Uh, are you guys going to uh, start a business? You guys don't have one. Make sure you guys uh, get with our course in the description box. You can do that. Uh, check out our one of a kind artwork at HealingThroughInspiration.com slash shop. Um, you also get our amazing apparel as well on the same site. You dig? Go ahead. Check us out. But I got to tell you all this. I know a lot of people talking about they don't have like land or whatnot, so they can't really plant their stuff. I had seeds and whatnot, because when I was out there in the forest, I went, uh, I believe it's eating mulberries. I was, I was eating mulberries. I just, it was some type of berries, for sure. I don't know, the main, the main man-made name doesn't really matter. Because I say, when you ask a deer, what was it called? It doesn't know. It really doesn't know. It doesn't know the difference between a blackberry name, the name of a blackberry, and a blueberry. It knows that it, it can consume because it's simply natural and it grows as in nature. I wanted to say all this. So I ate some of it. Um, I don't think it was necessarily ready because it was. A, I know at times it could be a lot sweeter. I did find one that was sweeter, but the ones I did eat, I did eat and they weren't as ready. They had left the seeds and I kept the seeds and let's put them in my pocket. And I planted two. And here, here I rubbed them in. But I'm about to show y'all, just like that, you can plant, just plant seed. Because I mean, I feel like this, this stuff, it's got space. You feel me? There goes one. There's another one. Put it in there. Put a little dash of water. I might have to put some more in there. Oh, it fell in there. It must be right there, god dang it. There is it. And it, uh, this is also too, I give you an update on my uh, garden. Because right now I'm growing alkaline electric. Alkaline electric food. Inspired by the great Dr. Sadie. You know what I'm saying? It's my Amrath over here. Holy cow. Apply pressure. Oh, yeah. Whoop, whoop. I do do that. Tell you, man, I got some space over here, so I might as well just use it, you feel me? Oof. We will be loud over here, I'm telling you that. For my winter squash. I'm telling you, I think this winter squash, I'm just over here blocking it, it takes, it takes more, um, Takes more water than the other plants. That's what I've noticed. Cause I water these things and I'm like, shoot, these leaves. It's like they want to keep turning. I believe. It, I swear to you, I give it water. I give it water. It's even watering it right now. But it's like, I give it so much. I water it at night. I water it at a.m. I water it occasionally. I check on it. <sighs> you know, my uh, sister Empress Copper Fox. She says that you know leaves change and whatnot. So it's probably just like, changing. Let me know what y'all think. Cause this stuff is real simple. Just grab some dirt, throw the seeds in there. You know, these are containers. Containers right there. These containers I already got from getting mushrooms. And this is my green onions. Just look at where the space is at. I got two more right here. The last two seeds. Let's see. I'm gonna plant them, plant them together. Plant them together, next to each other. Ooh. There you go. And that's it. And that's how you plant them. And I think too. I got a blackberry. I think these presents. Right, let's not get distracted. Uh, and there's my blackberry. I just had a blackberry because I had one over the forest. 
I'm not sure if it was the ripest because I had some. What that? I had some because it was the ripest, and then what I did was I ended up, I ended up having a seed. I just held it in my mouth until I got out of the forest, and then I put it into the ground, and I, I, I put it into the soil, and there you have it. And that sprouted up in probably like no more than three days, like one to two days, and I said, "Damn, look at this land." And I think this might be a grape seed. Yeah, that's a grape. Let me see from a grape, yeah. Because I got it over here, too. Yeah. All alkaline stuff. Still see water in it and whatnot. The sun's out, so, hey, the sun go do its work and stuff go evaporate and stuff like that. But, yeah. This, too, I want to just give y'all an update. And, two, if you're probably wondering, like, why the leaves are kind of weak. Uh, it's been kind of buggy at where I'm staying at. And I say buggy not as an insect problem, probably, like, as a... People problem because they said uh they they were tripping about you having your plants out or something like that. I mean, there's been a lot of stuff that are going on here. Now you've heard, if you've been watching the videos, you hear you've heard about. It. I'm not gonna talk about it here, <laughs> but just for the fact that somebody can't have their plants out, be self sufficient. But hey, maybe that's another subject, another time. But yeah, just want to give y'all last run run through. You know, stuff I'm growing: amrath, onions, you dig. Tomatillos, you know, winter squash, stuff like that. You know, Roman tomatoes, grape tomatoes, I think. I got a lot of stuff. You got you guys saw the stuff, but you guys wanna keep up. Amrath. Yeah, grape seed. I got grapes, you know, blackberry now, so and just the ones I planted here. I'm about to add a touch of water. Why not? Why not? Says, <laughs> cool, yeah. let me see where, where is the one I needed the most. Just a splash one hurt. A splash. You dig know what I'm saying? So that's what it is. But yeah. But yeah, man, you guys want to book a one-on-one -on -one consultation, you guys can do that. Send us a DM on Instagram at Hidden Through Inspiration. And check out our course. Check out one of our kind of artwork, HiddenThroughInspiration.com slash shop. And make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification. Leave your feedback on this one. We want to hear what you guys got to say, all right? Peace, love, and life.